Hey guys, it's Amy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be setting up my Enhypen binder. So Enhypen is a debut rookie group and I don't have a lot of their stuff right now, but I thought it would be fun to just kind of go through everything and make little spots for them in my binder. I'm also only going to be mostly collecting Jake since he is my bias. Um, I just don't really know if I want to collect anyone else yet but we'll see how things go. But for now, it's just gonna be Jake's album cards and like his lucky draw cards and maybe some of his special cards too. Okay, so I've already got a little list going <laughs> on how I want to maybe distribute the cards that aren't quite part of a set. So I've got my little list right here. So I don't know if this is gonna pick up very well on camera, but um, this is a little template that someone made. Um, I will leave there at uh, I don't know if you can see this, but I'll leave it below as well. But um, so far, this is the stuff that Jake does have out or soon to be out. I'm not sure if the first membership kit has come out yet. I decided to just go ahead and sign up for it. As of right now, I have completed this whole collection. I'm just still waiting on a lot of them to get here. So here is the binder I'm going to be using. And I think as of right now, my uh, TXT binder video just went up, so if you want to check that out, I'll leave a link to it. But this is the same binder as that. It is a one and a half inch Staples Pep Rally Better Binder. I love Better Binders. My friend Melanie got me into them. Also, um, this whole video is pretty much inspired by my friend Melanie's video. Uh, she just did her Enhypen un unboxing, and then she set up her Enhypen binder as well. And I really loved how you know she utilized um, the spaces and using like filler uh, sleeves and labels and stuff. So this video, Melanie, if you're watching this. <laughs> this is because of you. Thank you for the idea and the inspiration. Um, I love you. Okay, so this is just the TXT section right here, but we are going to flip to the very back. We are going to throw in some pockets for the Enhypen section. Okay, so I'm just going to use this um, divider. And these dividers are so pretty. They're from Target and they were inspired by Blue Moon V. I know she loves using those colorful dividers and it just really adds such a beautiful pop of color. So I've got some nine pockets ready to go. And then um, I'm using BCW pockets for this one just because I think they'll fit the postcards that came in Dusk and Dawn a little bit better. Although it really does bother me that they're so much shorter than my other pockets. So maybe in the future, um, I'll switch them out, but for now, this is fine. And let's see, let's just go ahead and I'm going to start with the postcards. And honestly, I don't know if I'm going to go in any order, but we are gonna be doubling them up. So let's do that and then we can just, I'll just go in the order that they came in. I'll just try to make it easier that way. So then, I guess the J will go on the back of that. And Jake will have to go on the back of Heeson. Okay, let's see. Hopefully this looks all right. I know that in Melanie's video, she was trying to decide if she should have the OT7 photo in the front or in the back. And I, <laughs> I can't really like decide either, but I like the way this looks right now. So we'll just, we'll just go with it. Okay, and then these two, and then, okay, yeah. <laughs> and then we'll put Nikki back here. Okay, so everyone's got a pair, which is nice. No one's gonna be left behind, no one left alone. <laughs> Sometimes that ends up happening when you have an odd number of pockets. So here is Dawn. I do apologize if my lighting is a little wonky today. Um, it's rainy, it's very rainy and just kind of blah outside. <laughs> so um, we do not have good lighting, but because of the rain, my neighbor's dogs aren't out. So it's a little bit quieter, which is really nice. <laughs>
I think it looks fine. Looks good, looks good. Okay, now we can get into the photo cards. I'm going to dedicate this first page for the uh, album photo cards. So I think I'm going to just have this be my page for Jake since I am just collecting his stuff from the albums and like his lucky draw cards too. So what I think I'm going to do is, let's see, I'll probably do do I want to do Dusk or Dawn first? I don't know. Um, like Dawn could be one, two, three. Dusk, one, two, three. This is his pre-order benefit. I think I'm going to put that on another page because on this bottom row, I'm going to do the uh, three lucky draw cards, which are on the way. So um, I will set him aside for a second. And then I do have He Sung and Sun, but... I think I'll put them on another page. Um, my friend Melanie ended up pulling him or else I would have sent him to her. But I think I'll just have them live, you know, in my binder as well, even though I'm not technically collecting them unless they're part of like an OT7 set. So let me go ahead and start sleeving them. Oh, I also decided to go with the lilac sleeves. They're my favorite color sleeves and they're by Ultra Pro. So I have a ton of them and I figured why not? just put them in here. I was debating blue, but um, when I put them in here just like for fun, I didn't quite like how all the blue looked. I mean, I did have blue, a blue page um, for TXT, which I thought turned out fine, but I don't know. I just think I might prefer lilac for and hyphen. I don't know. Obviously, like I can, um, you know, fix it <laughs> if they're removable. So, okay, we'll do the two dawns and then dusk. I already pre-made the little labels just so that things can go a little bit quicker. Oh my gosh. Okay, yes. And then, oh. Shoot, I did not sleep him. I still can't believe that I pulled Jake three times, you know, if you if you include the um the pre-order benefit card too. Definitely was my lucky day. I wish I had the same luck when I pulled Tae Young. <laughs> are technically uh, horizontal. I think they're both horizontal, so maybe I'll put them there. Then I think the common one is the only one that's vertical. I think. <laughs> I could look at the template again, but I'm pretty sure um, I'm right. So. Okay, so there is the first page, and yeah. <laughs> That's just how it's going to look for a while until all the other cards get here. And then, let's see, this page is going to just have some random things. Um, let me go ahead and put Jake in the sleeve first. I think what I'm going to do, since he's like literally the only card that I have right now of him, um, I might put him in the middle <laughs> just for the hell of it but I'll probably end up changing that out once the other cards get here. Um, but this one is the Chinese uh, pre-order card, I believe. And then we also have light stick and yeah, okay. The light stick one, actually, you know what? 
I might put the other members, should I put the other members up here, you think? Or maybe I'll put the other members next to him. Yeah, I'll put the other members next to him for now. I'll do that. PJ, pre-order, and then Jake's light stick photo card. I don't plan on buying the light stick. Um, I'm just not really a fan of the design, honestly. So that's why I decided not to get it. Um, but I did, <laughs> I don't know what is happening to my brain, but for some reason I was like, oh, you need the scrunchies, Amy, you do. So I got the scrunchies just so that I could get one of the one member random photos and then the OT7 cards. So I've got a placeholder for them. I'm hoping I pull Jake. If I don't, I'll just have to buy him. So it's fine. Um, and then it does come with an OT7 at least. So there's that, but yeah, I just can't believe that they actually fully released a clothing line and it comes with one random member photo and uh, an OT7 card. And I'm just like, what is happening here? Um, <laughs> I was totally not expecting that, but you know, I just, some of the stuff is cute, but I'm like, I don't think I'll wear, I'll wear it. So I didn't get any of the clothing and then there's an empty one. Okay, so yes, um, I have a feeling once the uniform OT7 picture gets here, I'll probably have it in the center um, and then kind of shuffle these guys around but for now. Yeah, this works. Let's go ahead and do the first membership kit. Now I decided on a whim to just go ahead and <laughs> sign up for the membership. Um, I thought it would be cool just to have a whole set of their cards so I just went ahead and I just, I'm just going to dedicate this whole page to that set. And I just abbreviated their names, but I hope I signed up in time to get the, the first kit anyways. And I ran out of pink post-its, so that's why Mickey's is yellow. And then we'll put some placeholders in here. There's that, and then the last nine pocket page is going to be for their season's greetings. I think the season's greetings comes with seven cards. Yeah, one for each member, and plus one like school ID. I think they're that's their concept. It's more of like a school concept, which seems to be pretty popular, you know, with K-pop season's greetings. But yeah, I already pre-ordered it. And I do plan on keeping the full set of the OT7. Um, hopefully I pull Jake for the random student ID card, but who knows? Oh my gosh, like, it's just, I feel like I may have already used up all my Jake luck, but let's hope that I didn't. <laughs> and then here's the student ID. Maybe should I have a student ID like up here? Yeah, sure, why not? And then there we go okay so that's for the season's greeting spread and then Melanie used a six pocket so I was like that's a good idea I think I'll do that too for the bookmarks but I really don't think I'm going to be collecting them I don't really see the point for me anyways but I'll just slide them down in the middle <laughs> they're just gonna look totally random just floating here but I don't know what else to do with them so that's my and hypen section. It does share a binder with TXT. And yeah, here is the first page. That's going to be Jake's photo cards from Dusk and Dawn and the Lucky Draw cards, some of his pre-order cards along with the light stick card. And we've got uh, Sung Hoon and He Sung as well. Um, yeah then the first membership kit, and then the season's greetings. <laughs> the random bookmarks, oh my gosh, I don't know, I might need to fill those in with some paper. And then we've got the dawn postcards and the dusk postcards. Love the vampire theme, <laughs> but 
all right i guess that's it thank you so much for watching please let me know if you like these type of videos i can do one also for my luna binder i actually am going to be upgrading it from my smaller binder to a larger one because that collection is growing but yeah just let me know um if you do like these type of things but for me personally i think um it's just going to be really nice to visually be able to see you know things start to fill up over time and i don't know if i'm going to go back into my bts binder to kind of do the same thing i know that there's some tay stuff that i am missing like some of his broadcast pcs you know like the older stuff but that stuff is more expensive and will take just a lot longer for me to collect which is which is fine but thank you so much for watching and i hope that you have a great day and i'll see you later bye